Welcome back to Farming Simulator, and today we're going to have a look at what happens if you chop straw with precision farming. Let's roll the intro and get to work. So I've got a field of barley in front of me. It is properly fertilized, has good nitrogen. I'm really not worried about the yield. What we're going to do is uh, harvest it. We're going to chop straw on some of it, and we're going to drop straw on some of it and see if we get a difference. It's a fairly short video today, uh, thanks to one of the guys on the Discord for pointing out that this may be a thing. So, starting off with chopping the straw and doing a bad job of harvesting. So, I don't have the chop straw mod installed at all on here this is just precision farming at work knowing that it's showing the yield meter in the bottom corner not the, the uh, nitrogen meter but man eh, what can you do about that we'll harvest some of this field and then we will jump into the map and have a look at what's happened Let's find out enable straw. Do a couple of rows of this and then we'll uh, we'll have a look. So I should have said that this field is all of the same soil type, so we won't see a difference due to soil type. So I picked this little field. do two rows and we'll just compare the difference between the uh, two sets that we've done so let's have a look at the map if we go down to the precision farming tab you can see it's all loam pretty much zoom in and then if we go across to nitrogen you can see that there is a small difference. All right, let's shut the combine off and we'll actually get out and have a look on the field. So we've got about between zero and 10, I guess. And then if we go over here, we've got about 40 to 50. If you're a regular to this channel, you know that I do like looking in the data. And uh, from the looking in the mod, precision farming gives you 25 units of nitrogen for chopping the straw onto the field. Which is probably better to get the straw, if I'm honest. But if you really don't want it, you get kind of a nice boost from uh, chopping it and it, it being worked back into the ground. Which I think is a really cool feature. If you found this video interesting, click the like button. Leave me a comment below, and if you're not already, subscribe to the channel, turn on notifications for updates on my future videos. Catch you next time.